Let's sew up all parts. Put the mouth between the eyes, like this. So the mouth between rounds nine to fifteen of the main body, between the eyes. Counting from the top, find rounds nine and fifteen. Let's start sewing. Then conceal the yarn tail inside the fabric, and finally cut off excess end. Cut off excess end. Next, sew the antennas to rounds two and three on the top of the head, like this. After you check the right position, let's start sewing. Okay, one antenna is sewn up. Sew up the other antenna in the same way, with round one as the interval between the two antennas. The antennas are sewn up. Conceal the yarn tail and cut off excess end. Sew the ears between rounds five and six of the body, bilateral symmetry. Also, let's find round five and six. After you check the right position, let's start sewing. Cut off excess end. Please sew up the other ear in the same way. Thread the white yarn through the needle and tie a knot at the end. Okay. Embroider a V shape on the forehead, covering the first six rounds of the main body.
thread in a random stitch and out from the top of the head. Cut off the excess end. Embroider a V-shape. The first V-shape pattern is completed. So the patterns on first six rounds of the main body. We'll demonstrate one more pattern here. We can sew a few more patterns in this area. In this area. Okay. This is what it looks like. Conceal the yarn tail inside the fabric. And finally, cut off axis end. Take out a red pom pom. Stick it to round three of the mouth with the hot melt glue. In this position. You can use a glue gun or a lighter to melt the glue stick. The elk is completed. Well, the Christmas dwarf for piece set is completed.